Well, I promised you a review of my Eco Trick uh, e bike. guys thank you so much for helping me put this together anytime you're welcome appreciate it yeah. i just said i have to do it from the other side of the i like this because i can step through which is really nice run run <laughs> <laughs> ah speed demon <laughs> it's gonna be fun Good and there. I feel like an, I can balance pretty good, see? Yeah, it's pretty cool. It, uh, yeah, it's pretty good. We'll get a, get over here in the sun where you can I see it a little bit better. Fine. Oh, yeah. I think I like it. That steering was right in the right place because I don't want to look down too far with yeah. my eyes. So that's perfect. The seat is perfect. Very cool. Everything is right here where you can see it, all within finger reach. That's kind of important. You know, you have to be able to get in there with your fingers. And then the throttle's right here. And still, if you have to stop some, do something fast, you have a handle which won't turn the throttle. Perfect. My first trip on my e-bike. Yeah, buddy. <laughs> so, I got an Ecotrick 500 watt, 36 volt, 20 inch uh, with fat tires. It's beautiful, actually. It's really nice. Has a gear shifter. Has, um, let me see if I can show you the other side. Those, this is the, the speed if you want to have them in low, medium, or high gear. And it's a seven speed Shimano with uh, disc brakes, I think they call it. Adjustable handlebars and even it has a little bell. <laughs> so you can see the pedals are folding pedals, and this is a folding bike. It's really nice. Uh, um, back rack on there so I can carry a basket then I, when I wanted to go dump my trash or take and get a jug of water at the water station I can carry it and then I have the ability to go visit people I'm always stuck in my truck I never seem to have 
the ability to go around and visit people and go see the sights. I'm so excited. This battery apparently will allow me to go with pedal assist about 40 miles, without pedal assist about 20 miles. So that's what I've been told. And look what Dan and Judy brought me, some <laughs> protective pads. I'll have to try them out to see if they, they will fit. I got a really cute helmet as a Schwinn. A nice helmet there with the turquoise like the color in the little decal. It's Dolphin, Eco Trick Dolphin. So I love the blue rims and it has reflectors on the front and the back. So it's very similar to Judy's bike. This is Judy's Eco Trick Dolphin. So I do have a step through on my bike. And anyhow, these are our three bikes together. We're going to go. Gonna, I took a going, short little 50 yard trip. Yeah, we, we're going to name ourselves what? The uh, Over the Hill 20s Club? <laughs> or something. The Three Musketeers. <laughs> <laughs> anyhow, we're going to have some fun on these. Uh, Dan is, and Judy are here for a day or two and visiting me, and we're going to have a ball. My eco trick is a 500 watt, 36 volt electric bike. It's a folding bike. The steering column folds down and the bike folds in half. I don't demonstrate that in the video. I just haven't recorded that. So anyhow, but I will show you a little, a little bit of what it looks like. It's a beautiful bike has beautiful rims, nice seat, uh, nice steering column. It's adjustable. I like this bike. It's easy to ride. It's seven speed Shimano gears and good front and rear bra brakes. I believe they are disc brakes. Uh, I can run 20 miles without the pedal assist on just the batteries or up to 40 miles with the pedal assist, depending how much I pedal, I guess. It's kind of fast taking off when you're pedaling, but if you use the throttle, it smooths out quite a bit. So I really like it. I'm comfortable with it now. I've taken it out a few times. I wanted to test it out in the desert, where it's lots of gravel, lots of rocks, and really bumpy road. I wanted to see how it does with the fat tires. And uh, actually it handled really well. My camera didn't do so well. But the bike itself held up, held, held up really well. And it doesn't have problems sliding. or if, Unless you slam on the brakes or something. That could cause a problem. But I think overall this was a very good purchase. And I will make... I want you to look in the description if you are interested in this bike. I got it on Amazon uh, around $700. I will put the link in the description under this video. So make sure if you're interested in anything on Amazon and I usually if I sh bought something from Amazon <clears throat> I will put the links in the description and I am an Amazon affiliate, so I make a few cents, whatever. I don't know how much. I haven't got anybody or anything yet for, through my links, but I will we'll make a stipend out of it. So if you want to click on the link and you're interested in this bike, go ahead and do so. Anyhow, um, also, I put extra information in the uh, description the things I may not mention in the video. A lot of people never look at the description on a video. I think it's kind of important because you find out a lot more. So I'm just encouraging you, if you want to, to look at the description. So here we go. Uh, a few pictures of me on the bike and what have you. And my ride through the desert. I took this phone. 
uh, my little Blade S10 with no gimbal. I left all the blunders and bouncing and <laughs> noise in the video. So maybe I'll take the noise out, just put a, a little bit of music to it. But you'll get to see all the rough road. Those, this is the way I live. So I wanted to make sure I had a bike that could hold up in this kind of a, a terrain. So here we go. Thank you. 